Today we're going to show you how to use the if error function in Excel. It's a handy tool that helps you avoid those pesky error messages and displays a custom message instead. View my caffeine addiction with a cup of joe, please. See the link in the description below. Here's how to write it. Equal sign if error open parentheses value this could be the rows or the formula that you want to evaluate for errors. Comma, value if error. This is the value or message that you want to return if the formula or function results in an error. Close parentheses, then hit enter. Imagine you have these two columns. You want to divide the first column by the second column, but you don't want to see a divide by zero error if the denominator is zero. Then write as follows. Equal sign if error, open parentheses, value, divided by value if error, comma, quotation mark, cannot divide by zero, end of quotation mark, close parentheses, then hit enter. We all love a good deal, and Casemate is here to deliver just that. See the link in the description below. Now apply the function to the whole column. In this example, if any of the cells is zero, the formula will return the message cannot divide by zero. Otherwise, it will return the result of the formula. Very handy, right? Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our Burn to Learn channel if you haven't already.